everybody and welcome back to the vlog. Today's vlog is just random. I just felt like vlogging today. I felt like looking good. I felt like putting some hair and makeup together. Uh, it's Easter. I'm out walking my dog. I'm not doing anything for Easter, obviously. Nobody is. And today is just gonna be about like what I'm doing. I'm currently walking my dog. I don't know, I feel like I just like bring you guys around like what a normal typical day would look like. Today's a little bit different because I'm bored. Come on, Vinny. So I actually, one of the reasons why I got all pretty and nice is that I'm gonna go pick up some flowers and try to get a good picture. And I thought I would uh, take you along with that. I just felt like doing a video on it. So today's vlog is just going to be like a day in the life. And um, I'm gonna take an Instagram picture, go pick up some flowers, walk, w take Vinny for a walk later. Not right now, I'm just letting him out to go to the bathroom because I wanna go before my hair falls out. And I did my hair like actually kind of cute today. I'm just wearing stripes and jeans. Yeah, it's Easter, so happy Easter. We watched church this morning. I took Vinny for an adoption appointment. So he is going to get adopted next weekend, which is crazy. If you have not already, go click the tag up above to watch how we fostered him. And yeah, that's pretty much it. It is actually beautiful outside. It's like supposed to be 68 today. So yeah, I'm gonna go get in the car and go get some flowers. Got the cash. Now we're gonna go get in the car and I'm gonna try to find a like farm stand to hop out real quick, get some flowers and come home. I kind of know of where two are, um, but we are going to go find some flowers somewhere. I have an idea of where I'm going. I'm trying to find like a local farm, farm stand. Somebody just texted me. Pick up some cute flowers, bring them home, bring my tripod out. Beeping. Um, bring my tripod outside and then try to take some like artsy fartsy pictures. So I have like $20. I passed a stand that they were selling the other bouquets of flowers. So maybe I'll get like two bouquets and give one to my aunt later tomorrow or something. Hopefully they still have them. I haven't been there for a couple days. So yeah, that's what we got. Let's get driving. All right, people, I am here. The lighting's really bad. I'm here with all the flowers. <laughs> and um, I stopped at a farm up the street and got like a little bouquet. It's half dying, but the family was out and it's Easter, so I just paid the $5. And now I'm at a different farm down the street. And these are like more like potted flowers. But I feel like I could still do something cool with a picture if like I'm sitting around them or something. So I think I'm gonna go with these three. It's three for 12. I'm gonna go get more money. I got this is the bouquet I picked up of tulips they're kind of dying but I thought for the picture and they're only five dollars and the family was out so I just felt like I should be giving back so I got those and then I got three different potted plants where I can put in a pot later and all of this was seventeen dollars all right so I got the flat in my car and now I'm going to head home and take a picture and try to figure that out but I feel pretty good I wish I a bigger bouquet or something but the farm that I went to that had the bouquets didn't really have a huge selection of flowers so all right so just got home these are the tulips they're kind of small but I feel like they look really pretty in um, camera and now it's time to figure out where I'm gonna take it how I'm gonna take it my sister's inside doing homework so she's no help but I don't know, I have to figure out, I have this like old bench, this old wooden bench that I could put up against the brick and do like sitting on the bench or something. I also have white rocker chairs that I could put in the front of the house or against the brick and do something with that. But like I'm trying to get this picture to be like creative and artsy and then I'm gonna put a preset over top of it and just kind of like play with the contrast and the colors a little bit. Brainstorming time. So first step is I brought my camera outside. Um, normally what I do for my Instagram pictures is I do like a self timer on my phone, which I might end up doing, but I just wanna see the quality of the camera outside. It's a really good camera. It's just kind of annoying to use because you have to link it up to your app and I have my flowers. I have the other flowers in the car, but I thinking for, for the first couple photos, I just wanna try it with a little bouquet. 
and I think I'm gonna see what it looks like with the bench up against the brick with me sitting on the bench and the flowers and kind of like, I don't know, we'll see it. And I'm gonna use my real camera, so let's get going. All right, so I just took a like trial run of photos with the tulips against this brick and I'm sitting, I'll show you like the kind of setup that I have. Um, but I wanted to start off with and say that majority of my pictures I take myself because for the last you know seven months I've lived by myself it is all about trial and error so I'm using a professional not, not professional like an actual camera um, normally I would be using my iPhone I think I already said that um, and some ways I think the iPhone would be better because you can see yourself in my camera I have to like look at my app make sure that I look good and then hit the timer and then I only have like three seconds to get into place and take the picture so I'll show you the setup um, I'm outside the lighting's a little bit much there's a lot of exposure so I think I'm gonna have to go into the app and, act and edit that out which maybe I'll show you guys that um, but I'm actually loving the brick with the stripes and the pink tulips I think it really pops and I'm wearing some light blue jeans that I think pop too so I'll show you the setup now all right, so this is the setup. Um, I have my camera on a tripod. Basically, with my, like where my head would be, that's where the camera is at. And then this is like my little backdrop. So I have this little, like worn down bench against the brick and then I have the tulips. And really cute, I love how the colors pop. In the frame, I only have the brick, so you can't see the side, the side yard, or you can't see the black, I think. Um, and you can't see the stones either. So I just have literally from like there up, um, again, which I really like. So these are my first couple photos and I'll have some um, on the screen to show you. So what I've been doing to get like the right pose is really like my jeans, I don't really like because I feel like they make my like crotch area look really big if I sit straight on. So I've been going to the side, as you can see in some of those photos, um, trying to elongate my legs, you know, make my waist look small, like the typical thing, make my booty look good. Um, and again, it's just like trial and error. So like if you don't like a picture, change it. Like I've probably taken probably close to 30 photos so far and this is just the first stop the first place that I'm taking them so like next I might get out my white rocker chair and try some against this background why do people do that um and then I also have other flowers that I might try to put them together but yeah that's what we got so far um yeah let's try another place all right so once I have taken um like a bunch of photos and I know that I have at least like one or two that I like um, just by looking off of like my phone I didn't blow them up on my laptop or anything I'll normally like move to a different location if I don't feel like I've gotten any I feel like I really like this spot I like how everything contrasts together um, and I think once I pull them up on my laptop the colors will really come out and then I can kind of tweak with the um, presets and for those of you at, like for those of you who are wondering, I don't know if you'll ask, I made my own presets, and presets are just like a fancy word for filter. Um, you do them through Lightroom, and if you go on my feed, like I'll put it right here, I kind of have like, kind of, I've been kind of bad with it lately, a cohesive like pink warm theme going on throughout my feed, and I'm just gonna layer one of those. I have two that I use. I have a really warm one, and then I have a warm cool one, um, and to be honest, you probably should have like five because every photo is completely different with exposure and everything. Um, I only have what I have, but I will pick one of either of the presets that I have, lay it over top of the picture that I choose or the pictures, um, and then play with contrast, all the other fancy words, brightness, um, like structure, stuff like that. Can you tell I do this? I mean, whatever. So once I do that, uh, once I like, so once I figure out that I have a couple that I like, I'll put them on my laptop. I'll show you kind of how I do that. Um, I will fix, play with the presets, figure out which ones I like, um, go in and like play with the contrast and the structure and all of that, um, and then save them and post them to my Instagram. So that's what I'm gonna do. I don't think I'm gonna pull out um, the rocking chair or anything because like I said, I really do like this background and like I like how the colors, colors contrasted. And my tulips are getting really wilty because I've been like playing with them all over the place. So yeah, now it is time to go in and edit and see what we like. So that's where we're at. Get your toy. Get your toy. Go get it. Go get it. Get it. Come on. <laughs> You're gone. 
funny. Did you miss me while I was outside taking pictures? Did you miss me? You wanna go for a walk? Oh. Did you miss me when I was outside? Oh my gosh. Come here. You're such a big cuddle bug. Yeah. <laughs> you missed me when I was outside. Guys, my hair already came out. I, I can't do the hair. Vinny, where's your toy? Get your toy. Get your toy. Get it. <laughs> ah! <laughs> you are rough. What do you smell, bud? What are you doing? Got back from our walk. This is my life. If I don't pet him, he'll request that I pet him. Well, maybe not. Yeah, dude, you. We went for like a mile and a half. Um, my face is looking really greasy. And I still have not eaten lunch yet, and it's like three, and I'm starving. And he's tired, and he wants a nap. So I'm probably going, oh, there we go. What, dog? You want to be rubbed? He's such a cuddle bug. Like, I've never met a dog more cuddlish or cuddler, whatever, than him. Um, I am about to eat food, watch some TV, edit the pictures, download them onto my phone, and then edit from my phone. I don't know how I'm going to talk you through me editing the pictures. I might not. I don't know. Figure out if it's easier. What's the easiest? Um, and yeah. That's what we got so far. It's not supposed to be up on the leather. It's just so precious. You really can't tell this dog no. Vinny. 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 <laughs> like, he's just a beautiful dog. Alright, so I just potted the flowers. I feel like that looks really cute. This face is like... I don't even know where it's from, but it has like different specks of red and orange. So I just put these Amstel Veronica's. I don't know. They just look pretty to me in this face. And then I did the two other daisy flowers. I potted them in a bigger potted pot. Somebody's just talking to me. <laughs> it's creepy. <laughs> you know? um, I just put the two other daisies in a bigger potted plant and gave it to my aunt. I didn't film it because she came up in the middle of me potting it. And I was like, oh. This is awkward. Um, I just gave it to her because uh, I was planning to for Easter. Like that. I just thought it was a little cute thing to do. Plus, I was supposed to wash her car this weekend, and I didn't, which I'm going to this week. Um, but I'm gonna go down in like 30 minutes for hot dogs. I love hot dogs. Not really. I like meals that are cooked for me. So that's what we got. All right. So basically, what I do when I edit a picture is I will go into the Lightroom app, and I'm actually thinking about changing this. Um, and starting to work with Photoshop. I just downloaded it on my phone and once I finish my homework, which I didn't even start for tonight, um, I'm going to learn how to use that and hopefully get into that. But I'm going to put my phone screen right here and kind of walk you through how I use Lightroom. So I'm gonna go into the app, pick the picture that I want. And as you can see, I have a few that I am liking and I will probably post maybe two to three. That's what I normally tend to do if I have more than one that I like. Um, so I will pick like, let's say this picture for my first one. I'll go into it and then I'm gonna hit my, scroll over to presets on the bottom, hit presets. And the ones that I have been going to are, I think they're like pink tones one and pink tones two. I use my own presets like I told you earlier. Um, and I'm probably gonna change that up. I think I wanna go more like a light bright white. I don't know, I'm gonna change the presets soon. So. This will probably be my last couple pictures. If not, if I don't completely change the preset before I post these, but we're just gonna go with it for the value of this video. This is what I'm doing. So I'm going to pick, let's say the lighter, brighter preset. I forget what it's called. It's really hard when I can't see it in my hand. So I'm gonna go with this preset. And right now I'm not liking how much, like there's a lot of warmth in it. So I can go and change the colors. I can go and change how much vibrance I want, saturation saturation I can go to structure um, I can play with the curve a little bit with just is like a cheat sheet with how to edit super quick um, I don't normally do that but when I do this is what it looks like 
Um, and yeah, so I'm just really just gonna play around with the preset on top of the picture until I find something that I really vibe with. And let's say it's this. So this picture I'm really liking. You can see if I hold it down, that's the before, and if I lift up, that's the after. Really liking it, vibing with it. I feel like it's gonna fit my Instagram nicely. It's gonna fit it nicely. It's just gonna like be pretty freaking cool. Um, so I'm going to go up and copy the presets on this particular photo and go with another photo that I really like, paste it, maybe change a few things, and then save that picture as well as the first one. And let's say I have another one, I'm going to go copy the same preset, the same, um, what's it called, same whatever's on top of it, paste it on another picture, and then I have three pictures that I'm really vibing with, so I'm going to go into my Instagram, think of a crazy cool caption, and upload the picture. So that's kind of like... A super quick version of how I edit my pictures I feel like this video is all over the place I don't really know if it's gonna vibe well together I hope that it looks cool at least my dog really wants me to rub him right now um, and yeah so my ah, feet hurt so yeah basically that is how I edit oh my goodness gracious um, that's how I edit and just kind of make my pictures look all cohesive and one like I said I'm probably gonna pick a new preset soon I don't buy my presets I will download a free one and then tweak it to how I like it and save it so basically I am pretty much coming up with my own presets kind of not um, but yeah so there is a quick few snippet of how I took the original picture, which is right here, and then transformed it into this picture right here. If you guys are interested in more of these videos, please let me know. I'm gonna try to like do, take a five minute crash course in Photoshop and try to learn how to use that now. Cause right now I'm only using Lightroom, which is an Adobe Creative Cloud app or whatever. And normally you have to pay, it's 20 bucks a month, but if you're in school, like a big university, Temple, Penn State, I don't know what else is the only two schools I know. Hack didn't have it. Um, they normally let you have Adobe Creative Cloud for free. Um, and that's how I'm using it right now. I don't pay for any of this shit. But if you want to, you can try it for seven days and get the free trial. And yeah, so that's going to be the entirety of this video. I hope you guys learned something from it or just enjoyed watching how my mind works in a day. And I'm gonna go eat some hot dogs with my aunt and uncle, put my dog in his crate for a little bit, come back, let him out. He still has not pooped today. Why didn't you poop today? He only poops when we take him for hikes. Like, we have to put him in a car, drive somewhere, and then he'll poop. But he won't poop if I take him for a walk around my house, which makes no sense. Also, I'm really loving this vibe, the lighting. So maybe I'll shoot, start shooting most of my videos from this. So ready for hot dogs and I'm already almost late. So I have to go eat some hot dogs now. Can you tell I'm ready for some freaking hot dogs? So. That's where we're at. Hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. If you have not already, um, make sure you follow me on Instagram at Peyton Becker. This is all for this video, vlog, day in the life, how I edit my pictures using Lightroom, maybe Photoshop soon, and this is my very cute dog, Vinny, who's leaving in about a week. That's all for today's video. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. I love you all. And again, I'm really vibing with this lighting. Bye-bye.